tonight. Sometime Friday morning, someone set a fire to a mosque on Morris Bridge Road in Thanoda Sassa. At this hour, that firebug has not been caught. Chip Osowski joins us now live from that worship center with the latest on this investigation. Chip. Well, and Jen, I can tell you the cleanup at this mosque is almost complete. And just because there hasn't been an arrest made in this case doesn't mean progress hasn't been made. The person who torched this place of worship may have wanted members to be angry, upset, and saddened. That arsonist failed. I need to praise God, first of all, and then thank the whole community. The amount of response, the positive response we've got, it's just unbelievable. Arshad Malik was one of the first on scene Friday morning. Sure, there was damage done, minor fire damage and significant water damage when the sprinklers were triggered. This is the main prayer hall which got damaged. The front portion of it, it was all flooded with water. Most of the damage here, as if you can see, is due to the water. What perhaps no one could have predicted following the fire and the flood of water is the flood of support coming from all over. I want to thank Allah by thanking all of you. Hours after the fire, dozens from all different faiths gathered to support those devastated by the incident. Many faiths standing behind those in Tampa's Muslim community. You've got hundreds of emails, text messages from all over the place, not only Tampa, Florida, USA, but UK and Canada. And fire rescue assures me finding the person responsible is a top priority. Right now we're looking at every uh, piece of evidence that was gathered from the scene. Uh, we're going through that very methodically, very slowly to make sure that we don't leave any stone unturned. And back live, as you can see, there are cameras all over this property. So it's likely the person that set this fire was captured on camera. Jen? Oh, well, then why not just release the video? Well, I did ask uh, Hillsborough County Fire Rescue about that. The public information officer told me that investigators are currently reviewing the video, and that simply takes time. In the meantime, they are simply asking for anyone with any information on this case to please come forward. Chip Mosowski, live in Hillsborough County for us tonight. Chip, thanks.